Hello everyone. Um, this is Alicia of Twist and Turbans and I would like to introduce you all to a awesome product that I came across, did some research um, about and I'm like, hey, you know, I was about all about going gray, but hey, if I can reverse uh, the gray hair strands, I would, I will. So, um, black strap molasses, and it is known for reversing gray hair strands, and is also known to, um, it's also great for <clears throat> scalp health and whole body health. If you having, you know, issues with, um, your muscles, a lot of tension in the muscles. Um, if you have anemia, which is, this is also high in iron, is high in calcium, it has a nice amount of calcium um, content, magnesium, and, um, uh, let me see what else, magnesium, iron, and calcium, and potassium. So it also has potassium in it. So all of this is great for skin health as well as bone health and overall body health it also has copper a little bit of copper it's not a lot of copper just a little bit of copper in it and all these come in zinc so all of these in, um, ingredients all of these uh, minerals combined and nutrients combined um, leads to also good skin health and it also leads to great scalp health and hair health also so how to take this for total hair health and skin health you want to take one to two tablespoons of this a day you're not going to just pour it on the spoon and just eat it by mouth you can add it to your smoothies you can add it to um, your water as a sweetener for the water you can add it to your oatmeal <laughs> and you know, more or less, to your coffee too. This also tastes really good with coffee or tea. You can add that to your tea. And um, it's also great if you're like a diabetic, it's a great sugar substitute for those who have diabetes. Um, and the purpose of taking this is, like I said, total skin health and total hair health and I'm going to add this to the hair challenge also this will be a great um, thing to add to the hair challenge to document your hair growth progress if your hair is graying you can document take pictures of your hair before when your hair is grayed out and then every three to four months you know take additional photos just to see how if your hair is progressing if um, the grays are um, going away or becoming more minimized as far as the grays and just document that whole process and then by December 2019 um, you can take another great look at your hair strands and see if all of the gray strands are all 